Hey, this is my Olympia Splendid 66. I took the shell off. Um, I didn't take any video before I took the shell off. The shell is down here in four, four pieces. And here are the screws and my little, this is a magnetic bowl, which I highly recommend. Um, so let's see, and I was having a hard time getting it to fail this morning, which is funny. It was failing a little bit. Um, but so far, yeah, there, stuck, okay. But it was getting stuck a lot. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so that's the problem that, that I ran into yesterday after typing four or five pages without any problems to speak of. So... Um, I'm not sure if I can, maybe I'll turn the light on and, uh, continue the video underneath. I'll see if I can, it's kind of hard without a tripod, but I'll try, I'll see what I can do here. Okay, got the light on, we're going to tip it up, and the area I'm looking at is right in there, and let's see, I'll, I'm going to start tapping this and see if you can see it moving here. It's, uh, okay, here we go. This is nice. Will it fail? This is the escapement, I believe, that we're looking at, basically. There. So, <clears throat> that's that wide bar there. That is connected to the space bar. That's that's where the motion goes down to this thing. But um, I need a better setup to to video my troubleshooting. But that's the area I'm looking at, um, and in between, I guess it's kind of hard to get to. I might try to get to clean a little bit since it seems to be working better after uh, exercising it a lot. A lot of times typewriters kind of fix themselves if you just type on them, but it's not its not completely fixing itself, so I think there's something in there I need to check. Maybe something's bent. Maybe it needs to be cleaned. All right. 